know I'm gay. TABC. I've had five fake IDs taken from the square and I've come back every time. I'm an alcoholic. I go to Texas State. Size matters, but not the height. F you ass shit, I hate you. I got with this friend. But at least you had fun getting chlamydia, right? My sister. I peed my pants out of my friend's birthday party. You like Texas State? Yo, what's going on guys? We are at Clemson University. We're getting to the bottom of the questions you guys are too afraid to ask girls, and even some guys. We're gonna get to their craziest college confession, maybe a little bit of what their parents don't know, because we all know college is a freaky, freaky time where the worst in you comes out. So we're gonna get to the bottom of everything, as well as the last one's the most important is, does height really matter? So guys, stay tuned to the end. There's gonna be a surprise, and of course, there's gonna be baddies throughout the video, so guys, let's get right into it. The people wanna know, what is your craziest college confession? Like some crazy you did. Midgets. How was it? Great time. Great time. Great time. I was there for that. Like recording, watching, or? Can't comment too much <laughs> on that, but midgets. Come here, craziest college confession. Uh, well, my freshman year, I got kicked out of the dorm because it was COVID and we had hella people over and alcohol, and you can't have either of those things in the dorm. So, underage and during lockdown, pretty yes. much. What about a worst first date experience? I didn't go. <laughs> you ghosted him? I so did. Why? It wasn't my type. Why didn't you just tell him that? I didn't want to be rude. I, I don't do first dates. I'm more just like a, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Like, so you're not a relationship gal? No, I am, but like, I don't need the dates and the nice So the you're just more like hang stuff. out, get to yeah, know each yeah, other? Yeah, more of a hang out. Would you date a guy shorter than you? I have a lot of short kings that watch my channel. Oh, I did. I did too. My first boyfriend was. So for all the short guys watching, they have a chance. Hell yeah. Yeah, well, right they do. But I what is the worst first date experience you've ever had? Okay, so I just got out of a toxic relationship and he put his hands on me and then went to 6th Street and was on the same type of like video like this made out with five f you ass shit, I hate you! Did you at least, did you get your get back on him? Yeah, I got with this friend. Side note, this just goes to show height doesn't matter, it's all about the way you carry yourself and the confidence you hold. I need y'all's craziest college confession. I peed my pants out of my friend's birthday party. I was trying to guard the drinks and I said, I gotta go party and no one was helping me. And I went party in my pants. I want a flat red train on me. He doesn't know I'm gay. What's yeah, your what's a college question? I got fired from a job over serving alcohol. DABC. What's your guys' craziest college experience? When I got an MIP at this tailgate right here two years ago. Craziest college confession. Uh, oh, my craziest confession. Yeah, let's hear it. Um, when I was a freshman here, I got hit by a train though. He's taken from the square and I've come back every time, but now I'm 21, so we're good. But like I blacked out and I had to be carried up my stairs naked. There's a video too. There's a video? Craziest college confession. I have pink fluffy handcuffs. I have two vibrators too. I'm an alcoholic. I go to Texas State. You like Texas State? No. So I joined the military when I got out of high school. So I did that own thing. But now I get really drunk and I go home and watch Shrek and I confiscate a bunch of from all the bars. I go and steal all their signs and shit. What, what's your greatest city slash square experience? We used to be Vodka Street, and all like the older baseball guys would take us to Vodka Street. There's these big windows, and so like they would go talk to the bouncer, and they would give us like the thumbs up, and like we would jump through these windows, and these people would help us get in. My yeah. craziest college confession is I'm in a loving, stable relationship. Oh, and I had chlamydia one time. Strep is worse. It's all the same shit. It's bacteria. Fuck it. But at least you had fun getting chlamydia, right? My sister. What's your Worst first date experience. He made me put the check. Our generation isn't like old school anymore. They're trying to like it's more hookup culture, less dating. Do you think it's harder for people to find like genuine relationships now? It's more like let's just go hook up. So there are still girls out there that want a relationship though, right? Yeah. It's just the guys suck. Yeah. Would you ever ever date a guy shorter than you? No, I'm already short enough. I can't. Short guys. Short guys forever. They're hot and they have better. What about you? Where's first date experience? What are we talking about? During the lockdown, we went hiking. I was like, okay. He minutes. took our hiking first red <laughs> flag. Five minutes into the hike, she said, let's go in the back of your car. Did you yes or no? Yes or no is the only answer. Yes. <laughs> Guys, this is the exact pro tip I wanted to save for the very end. And if you made it this far, you won 
probably feel a little bit better about yourself if you're short chain. Yeah, there was maybe one or two girls that were like, nah, no chance, but let's be real. A lot of them were like, dude, I don't care. It's all about the confidence. And guys, when it comes to confidence, put yourself in situations where you're uncomfortable. But guys, the more you get out of your comfort zone, the more room you have for growth. Now we're on the road to one milli, guys. We are so freaking close. So continue. One thing I want you to do, since you made it this far in the video, is go down below and absolutely smash the subscribe button. We're almost there, baby. We're gonna keep pushing, we're gonna keep grinding. Best content's coming for you guys. This was way out of my comfort zone. I told you guys that, but we still got it done. I love y'all. Till the next video, peace.